It's Shonda Pierce, and she's kind of a big deal. I'll go ahead. Sit down. You ever have a hot flash in the sand of Afghanistan? <laughs> With the spikes on and the metal, that friction will... <laughs> like a walking sparkler. I told General Webster, you let some menopausal women come over here packing? We will shut this war down right now. That's all it takes, you know, Osama is your mama. I was with the Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders. They were cheerleaders and I was Dallas. Them and some skinny girls. And this is true, I cannot tell you how many times I heard from my mother, you are going to hell in a handbasket for that. Isn't that precious? <laughs> I think I was about 16 or 17 when I asked her, how big is the handbasket? <laughs> Me and four cousins are going to hell in the same handbasket. <laughs> and who is carrying the handbasket to hell? That's what I wanna know. I say we take that guy out, we'll be eternally secure. Expect. They didn't have any books when I was expecting. Nothing. We had one children book, one how-to book. Dr. Spock wrote it. <laughs> Dr. Spock, you remember that paperback? Like, I'm gonna have an alien telling me how to raise my youngin. <laughs> he says, I'm okay now, but I, I just tell you, I was, I was in my boat with my chainsaw. <laughs> He's a relatively brilliant man. I was in my boat with my chainsaw. Immediately thought of Sesame Street. One of these things do not fit the other one. It's her humor, honesty, and warmth that makes Shonda Pierce the number one Christian comedian in the world. Shonda Pierce, I'm kind of a big deal. In stores everywhere.